couple years ago when we had a significant snowstorm, uh, and it was an isolated snowstorm where we, you know, as in Northwest Indiana, you as you know, we get a tremendous amount of lake effect snow. <clears throat> in a particular morning, two winters ago, a plume of snow, lake effect snow, was coming off of Lake Michigan and dropping over the city of Gary. And it was actually isolated within the city of Gary too. It was basically from Broadway downtown to Klein Avenue, right where I work. So it was a pencil effect just all day long dropping off of Lake Michigan. And in a 24-hour period, I believe it was around 23 inches of snow fell, give or take, but in that neighborhood. Gary was overwhelmed trying to keep up with it. Traffic had come to a, a standstill. I was trapped in it for a while. I was able to work my way out of it. But uh, the mayor of Portage, on his own, called up Karen and the administration, Gary, and offered to send help. Even knowing that he probably, politically speaking, in his own town would take a, batting for it, or a beating for it, he did. But as he said many times, I'd do it again because it was the right thing to do to reach out to our neighbor. And that's what we need to do to make a difference. Throughout the local media, and that uh, I know he was challenged from some of the council members that maybe uh, didn't agree with his decision. But uh, he... On numerous occasions, even though he was challenged and some folks maybe thought it wasn't the right thing to do, uh, to send trucks with their taxpayers' money to Gary, his answer was, look, it, <clears throat> if that storm would have shifted and went this way, 10 miles the other direction, it would have been us, and we would have been looking for help because we wouldn't have been able to keep up with it. And I would want to be able to reach out to Karen or hope Karen would reach out to us as well. And uh, he says, because that's what he believed is that you have to help each other. I think Lake County and Porter County are probably better neighbors and, and friends and share and have uh, a mutual cooperation with each other better today than they ever have. I think there's probably still always going to be some division and uh, just because that's politics. If you look at it today versus years ago, I, you know, I don't know if there was ever a, a big division or a big wedge between the two, but I think that there was obviously some just because of the, fa the problems that Lake County faced with the big three uh, inner cities of Gary, Chicago, and Hammond being part of the county. As time has grown and time has went on, they do face a lot of challenges in Porter County and some of their own uh, things that have happened along the course of time. Maybe they better understand it. Me personally, what I see, my opinion is I don't think there's a big division between the two.